remembering a businessman who left an indelible mark on Kansas City. Henry Block, co-owner of H&R Block, has died at the age of 96. With his brother Richard, he started the tax preparation company that has its new headquarters downtown and employs thousands. But he did so much more for his hometown. At UMKC, the Block School of Management was founded more than 60 years ago and has been recognized for teaching future entrepreneurs. The new addition at the Nelson Atkins Museum bears his name, and the museum now houses his art collection. KCTV5's Amy Anderson has more on Block's many, many contributions to Kansas City. These are just some of the classic works of art that Henry Block gifted the Nelson Atkins Museum of Art. Tonight, the people here at the museum and across the city are remembering Block as the true gift. His personal passions, like devoting time for the arts, were just something that we'll cherish forever. Henry and Marion Block's art collection is one few can begin to imagine, and one they generously donated to the Nelson Atkins Museum of Art years ago. It was something Block planned to do after his death, but he had a change of heart. He wanted to see the happiness that collection would bring to others firsthand. And that was a great satisfaction that he did get to enjoy it with his family, with his children and grandchildren. And in the openings of those galleries, you could see the joy in his face of seeing his familiar paintings mixed with our paintings. Tonight, the museum is mourning the loss of the man they all adored. He's influenced by always praising and trying to make things better will be missed forever. Yet his legacy is what predominates and he'll be ever present because everything he has contributed to the city. And just a few miles down the road at UMKC, students thrive and succeed at the Henry Block School of Management. He's demonstrated for our students that you can achieve great success and do great good. He emphasized the importance of working hard, taking risks, flying right, and helping others. Block's philanthropic path went on for miles. He is one of those people who walked the walk, who made a difference, a man Kansas City will never forget. Block's funeral is private, but a memorial service will be held here at the museum on Monday, and it is open to the public. In Kansas City, Missouri, Amy Anderson, KCTV5 News.